Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to another weekly vlog. Before the vlog gets started, I just wanted to mention a lovely package I received last week. And this brand that I'm going to talk about is not new at the not new in my YouTube channel because I have actually had products from the brand before um, and you might remember if you've watched the vlogs for a long time if not it's basically this jewelry brand based in New York called Anna Luisa and they kindly gifted me these earrings along with another couple of pairs last year and if you notice this if you've watched the vlogs if not um, you wouldn't know but I don't ever take these out really these are like my everyday I go to bed in them I shower in them I don't take them out I wear them for work I do like mix it up if I wear like a little stud I got some studs for my wedding and I've um, worn them a few times but I basically majority of the time always wear these and they asked me if I wanted to work again with them this year and of course i love their products so i was like yes i would absolutely love to so last week they sent me over some two new pairs of earrings and this first pair these ones are like a little silver plain hoop and i actually wore these in last week's weekly vlog you might have noticed i had a bigger hoop in you might absolutely not have noticed um, and i love them and i'm gonna wear these again today and i'm actually gonna put these in my jewelry clean at the clean because they need it um, I haven't actually cleaned them since I got back from Italy so they need cleaning and they also sent me this other pair which I actually picked both pairs but I actually got a gold pair as well which is this little pair and I just thought that they were so different so I got a silver and a gold pair I don't wear many like well I don't wear much gold jewelry but I thought I'm gonna try these out and yeah, I'm not wearing them today. I'm going to wear the silver pair and I'm going to take these other ones out and clean them. But I just wanted to mention that because honestly, the products are gorgeous and like these earrings, apart from being a little bit dirty because they need a clean, are like the perfect condition still. Um, and I do really love the brand. They've got some gorgeous jewellery on their website. You can do like um, little necklaces with initials on there's bracelets with initials on there's studs there's hoops there's all sorts and i do have a 35 percent off link which i will leave in the description box down below and there's also a code if you want to shop anna louisa at any time which is page s20 i think it's page s20 let me just double check just so i don't get that wrong Yes, page S20, which I will leave on screen and in, and in the description box as well if you want to shop when the 35% offer has run out. But I just wanted to mention them and look how cute those are. I love them. I had them on in last week's vlog. Um, but I thought they were a bit different. They're a little bit bigger than the um, ones I wear all the time. Um, but yeah, thank you so much to Anna Louisa for gifting me those earrings. I love them. Like I say, already had them in and I never take the other pair I wear that I got gifted out um, but yeah that's just a little exciting package I got and today my plan is I'm actually ready as you can tell I'm going out with my friend Megan we're gonna go to a cute farm shop we're gonna get lunch and do like a cozy little Christmassy farm shop day and um, before I go I am actually just gonna quickly clean my rings and my earrings just to leave I'll leave them actually um, at home obviously um, but I just want to clean my rings so they're nice and sparkly I'll also show you what I use to clean my jewellery I did mention this in a few vlogs ago um, but it's honestly amazing and it was from Amazon this girl who came into work told me about it and it's really fabulous so I'll show you that um, but yeah I'm excited for a cute cozy Christmassy day um, it's not the best weather outside so it is like a cute farm shop vibe kind of day um, but yeah, let's get on with the video and like I say, I will leave all the links for Anna Louisa down below so you can go and shop and have a little look on their website. And it's such a nice gift as well, by the way, I didn't actually mention this, but it's such a nice gift for people for Christmas. Um, so yeah, go and check it out. So these are the two things that I use to clean um, my jewellery. This is obviously the cleaner 
um, which is like a vibration sort of stainless steel tank and then this is just the jewelry cleaner liquid I'll leave the links for them both in the description because honestly it is 12 out of 10 amazing I always put it on for like two rounds of like on and off basically so I do it for two rounds and they come out sparkling so it's just finished I'm gonna pop it on again I don't know whether you can tell how clean these look but compared to when they went in have a look how good they look they're the earrings they're so sparkly you can see more there that's my earrings and then and that's my rings looking all sparkly too like literally glistening so I'm just about to leave the house and I want to quickly say about this hack that I've done this morning. Um, my friend basically told me about it and said she'd seen it on TikTok. She actually told me about two hacks. I did one the other day and I've done one this morning. This morning's hack was how to clean your microwave. I know this sounds very housewife life, so if you're not interested, skip ahead. But honestly, it's such a game changer. So you've got to put like a hot bowl of water. Well, get a bowl that you can put in the microwave. Use I use boiling water and then cut some lemons up and then you put it in the microwave for five minutes, like on with the power on, then you leave it for 15 minutes with the door shut when it's done. Then honestly, all of the dirt just comes away from the microwave and I'm not even joking. It's the most satisfying thing I think I've ever done. I'm gonna show you inside the microwave, which I never would do or never would have done before it's this clean, but honestly, it is sparkling. Let me show you. Look how clean it is. I'm not even joking, it's absolutely sparkling. So if you need a little sign to go and clean your microwave, it's the most <laughs> easiest thing I've ever done. And the satisfaction is real. I've got the like spinny plate that goes on top to go in the dishwasher because I want to clean that in sort of that way and put that in the dishwasher. But honestly, wow. The other hack she told me was how to clean your washing machine inside. So you have to just tip bicarbonate of soda in and put your washer on like a rinse. And it, honestly, it's gleaming and smells insane when it's done. So yeah, there's a couple of hacks. They are on TikTok, so that's where she found them. But honestly, it the microwave one has been a bit of a game changer because it's so sparkling. I don't even want to use it. So I said to Jake, if you dirty this, there's trouble. But yeah, anyway, I'm going out now to meet my friend Megan. I'm going to go and try and get her some flowers before I meet her because I just want to get her some little cute white roses. Um, so yeah, let's go and have a fun little day. Got some little cute roses for my friend. And no one else was ever be. The little haul i got some christmas napkins how cute are those half a watermelon and some steak pies <laughs> Morning everyone, welcome back to my weekly vlog. I did already film a clip this morning, I was showing you what I was having for breakfast and I've never had that in absolutely years, like cereal with cereal with banana on, I don't know, but it was so good. And I'm not gonna lie, I could have slept for like <sighs> the whole day today, I feel exhausted, I'm not even sure why, I just feel really tired. Um, but I'm ready and I'm going to the Metro Centre with my friend Lucy. We're then going to go to Costco because she wants to pick up something for our dog. Oh, I've just noticed the wind has thrown all of the recycling bin on the grass. That's great. We need to pick up all that. 
there's beer bottles in the middle of the grass um but yeah we're gonna have a lovely day it's really wet today same as yesterday so i'm glad to be doing something otherwise it would just be a day like stuck in the house really so we're gonna go to the metro i need an outfit for saturday night because i'm going to my cousin's 30th on saturday he's having a party so i need something nice to wear pray that i find something um and i just i want to get some new bits if there's anything to get um, I'm going through this phase where I just want to chuck out so much of my wardrobe and I've already started going through it. I did mention this in last week's vlog or the week before. Um, but I've just like got rid of loads of stuff that I just... For example, it was summer stuff that I haven't even worn this summer. So I was like, I'm never going to wear it if I haven't worn it this summer. So I've chucked quite a few bits out. Um, I've got like one full bag and then half a bag already and then a full bag of shoes and it honestly feels so good but i feel like i just need to have a day where i just do it and go through it all so i have got like five days off coming up at the end of the week so i think i might get in, like stuck into that this weekend and just get rid of loads of stuff because honestly my wardrobes are bursting at the seams so are jake's so i feel like he needs to do his i need to do mine and just have a good cleanse before christmas um ready for the tree going up even though it makes no difference because the tree goes downstairs but i think it's just like a mind thing um but yeah i'll take you along for my day with my friend lucy i'm so excited to see you we've not had a day together in so long so i'm so looking forward to it um, and hopefully i pick up some good things and i can show you what i get um i've got this little bodysuit on it's just a gray bodysuit but it's from pull and bear the one my mum and dad got me from tenerife and it's so nice and i've got my leather jacket on with jeans not sure whether it goes. I asked Jake, I was like, does this go? Um, but I kind of like it. And it's kind of weather where you need a little bit of a jacket because it's not hot at all. Um, but then when you go shopping inside, you don't want to be too hot. So I feel like it's the perfect outfit. I'm going to put some trainers on and let's get on with my day. Also, got my earrings in still. Didn't even take them out last night, but I've still got the silver ones in but hopefully in this vlog i'll put the gold ones in at some point i got so many messages about the gold ones when i put them on instagram yesterday so like i say all the codes are in the description box but yeah let's get on with the day At least he's just getting herself all ready for winter. Yeah, I think the hat really, really suits you. I think you should buy two. I did about an extra stone on this. <laughs> just trying on some muffs. <laughs> Lucy says she's like a DJ. I can't honestly hear you anything. <laughs> then don't you? Have a holly jolly Christmas. There's, I'm actually shocked how much there is. I did not know they had this shop here. This has changed. There's some good stuff. Some lush stuff. Morning everyone, welcome back to my weekly vlog. I thought I would just start my morning by showing you what I picked up at the Metro Centre the other day because I got home and me and my friend just had food and like chilled and I just didn't pick up the vlog again. Um, so I just thought I'd start by showing you what I got and I'm not going to lie, I was so impressed with the Metro Centre because I needed an outfit for tomorrow night which is my cousin's 30th birthday party and I can never normally just go to the metro and like pick up an outfit. I just don't think that happens anymore but I did. I got a little outfit from Zara but I also got a few more bits while I was at the metro so I thought I'd just show you. So let's show you my outfit first. I probably will put it in this vlog tomorrow night what I get what I'm like how I'm I can't get my words out like show you my outfit on because I'm not going to try it on right now just because I'm all cozy and it's cold but I got this black skirt with like silver buckle detail and it has a little slit up it as well like I say I'll show you it on tomorrow night when I'm all ready and things but I thought that was really nice and kind of like or well kind of Christmassy a little bit and I thought I'd get more wear out of the skirt as well like maybe for work um or over the christmas period 
Then to go with it was this little like halter neck. It's really, I'm not really doing it justice. Halter neck top. You can't even tell. It just looks like a black looks like nothing actually it's backless but like i say i will show you tomorrow night or if i don't if i've ended the vlog already i'll have in, i'll insert some clips of how it looks but i actually tried that on in a medium the top and it was quite big so i then ended up getting it in a size small so i need to actually try that and make sure it fits because if not i'll be a little bit stuck but i think it will fit because the medium was really really baggy but i was really happy with that outfit the skirt was 29.99 and the top was 25.99 and I didn't mind paying that because I think I'll get quite a lot of wear out of them both over the festive period and I think they were from the festive days collection from Zara which is like the Christmassy section so I did actually try other bits on as well in Zara but that's all I actually got and then I went to Primark and when I got the Metro Centre with my mum, she doesn't really like looking in Primark but my friend was like happy to have a good mooch so I had a really good look around and I actually got this cropped blazer. I'll try it on over my jumper actually, just so you can see. And um, from the Rita Ora collection, and it's gonna be so good for work. Just like, makes everything look smart. I mean, it looks really nice with this jumper. But I thought, how nice is that? It's got like a, um, like a real, like a satin piece here on the um, collar and stuff. I thought that was so nice. And like I say, cropped. So that'll go with loads of my work outfits. So I loved that. Um, and like I say, that was from the Rita Ora collection. And actually, she had such a big collection. I wasn't expecting that. I felt like she took over Primark. Um, and that was £22. And I know I'll get so much wear out of that for work. Got that in a size 12 because they didn't have a 10. No, I'm lying. I'm lying, aren't I? Did they have a... I basically tried an 8 or a 10, I can't remember. And then I was going to get a 14 because that's all there was. And then the further around I got, I found the 12 and it's so nice. So that was what I picked up in Primark. Nothing wild, but just one thing. Um, and then went to TK Maxx and got this really gorgeous little Christmas sign. I thought this is going to be cute. Not sign, it's like a Christmas ornament. I thought this would be nice for the kitchen table. And it just says Joy with like a marble bottom and I thought that would be nice with some candles around for the Christmas table um, when I put my Christmas tree up. So I feel like I had a successful shop if I'm honest. Um, yeah I did. We went to Wingstop for lunch like you'll have seen as well and I didn't actually enjoy it as, mu as much as I normally do, I don't know why but yeah it was still nice, just wasn't as like amazing as I usually find it but today my plan is i'm now off work for five days which is just bliss um so today i'm gonna go and get my nails done which are desperado these are the nails that i had put on in rome and i wanted them to last because they were 55 euros and they have lasted honestly about six weeks i think yeah i think six weeks which is just crazy um i had them done at like the start of october I think it is about six weeks so I'm happy with that but I'm thinking I'm gonna get them red because my toes are red and I want I was thinking red nails with my outfit for tomorrow night would look really nice and um, I've actually got some new Zara shoes which I've had for ages but I haven't worn them I think I'm gonna wear them with the outfit and yeah I've got a really nice weekend planned and um, the vlog will probably be split over like this vlog and the next vlog you'll see what I get up to but I will take you along for my day it's so sunny outside but it feels really cold um, I've just had a productive morning of like cleaning up, tidying, felt good, feel productive. Um, but yeah, that is my plan of the day. Go get these nails done ASAP. Um, and yes, at some point I need to try that outfit on, otherwise I will have to pop to the metro to get the bigger top tomorrow. But I don't think I'll need to, fingers crossed. But yeah, let's get on with the day and I hope you like what I picked up at the Metro Centre. That was quick, but I was just emptying my bag of like receipts and I found this little Jo Malone um, perfume card. And I just wanted to mention, me and my friend went into the Jo Malone store and I'd actually already smelt it, but their new Christmas scent ginger biscuit, excuse me, oh my goodness. It's honestly the nicest, nicest fragrance. I had actually smelted it at work and I was um, saying to my friend, smell this candle. It's 
beautiful. If you can go and smell it, go and smell it because it is like Christmas in a candle and it's so strong. Um, I can still actually smell it on here. Um, I actually said to the girl as well yesterday at work on Joe Malone, I said, oh, I don't think I'd really wear the fragrance because I love it as a candle, but I'm not sure I'd wear it as a fragrance. And she was like, actually, it does smell so good when it's like settled. And I was thinking, hmm, maybe I should try it. But yeah, just thought I'd mention the Joe Malone Christmas scent. I think there's three Christmas scents, but the ginger biscuit, go smell it. It's amazing. Whew. So I've got two huge bags of clothes in the boot and a huge bag of shoes to chuck out. And honestly, the cleansed feeling I have is just amazing. I can't wait to get rid of them. The house feels already tidy, even though it's probably made like no difference. Um, there's definitely some spare coat hangers, but yeah, you can probably see the boot is full. But I'm gonna go and get rid of them and then I'm getting my nails done. Do I go for red? Am I gonna regret it? I'm really not sure, but I do feel like I want a little red moment. Then I can have French for Christmas, I suppose. So I'm back from getting my nails done. Went for a little red moment. And I'm now just about to pop our bedding on, which is all freshly washed, it smells gorgeous. So yes, let's do the bed. <laughs> So me and Jake have just been out for lunch and I forgot the vlog, I left it on the bench so I didn't obviously take you along. We just went to a place in Seam called Grill and Chill which Jake absolutely loves. Um, I look really shiny, sorry about that. Um, now I'm just gonna sort the house a little bit, put the rest of the bedding on and then I'm actually going to meet my mum for a walk and I need to wrap up because it's cold out there. So that is the plan of attack. Morning everyone, welcome back to my weekly vlog and happy Saturday. Me and Jake are off out for lunch today. We're going to this farm shop that I haven't been to in quite a while actually. We're gonna have lunch there and then we're gonna get some pie to take home um, for like tomorrow night. It's like the best corned beef pie from there, honestly, it's so good. I look quite brown because I've got my tan on all ready for tonight. Um, all excited for my cousin's birthday party. And yeah, I just thought I'd intro the vlog, but we're off out. Got my little red nails on, they look so much better with tan, don't they? But yes, we're off out and I'll take you along for my day. Another day, another farm shop. Takeaway hot chocolate. So we've had the most lovely Saturday. I'm now just chilling. I've got a hot water bottle because the house feels really cold. So I've got a hot water bottle, just editing the vlog and I'm gonna start getting ready in like an hour. I might have a little nap just before tonight, I'm not sure. Um, but that food was so good earlier. Oh, it was literally delicious. Um, and the farm shop was so nice. I ended up putting that pie back that I showed you in my basket and we actually got a bigger one. So yeah, we're having that tomorrow night. Um, and it's just been the nicest Saturday, I've got to be honest. Um, fab weekend off vibes. And yeah, I will show you a little bit of my getting ready process later and I'll show you my outfit when it's all on. 
and apart from that just gonna chill maybe watch some youtube and this is what saturdays are all about <sighs> So I've got my outfit on, but I don't know what shoes to wear. I have, hang on, the choice, the choice is between two. These new ones from Zara with a little bow on, small heel, or my Steve Madden's with a high heel. I really can't decide. Oh, but I love my outfit, which is a positive. It's actually so nice. The only thing is I'm going to be cold, so I need to put some sort of jacket on, which I didn't think about until today. So yeah, let's just figure out the shoe first. Make me sweater, make me hana. So this is the outfit. I decided on the Steve Madden shoes. It feels so nice. I really love the outfit, even though it's all black and I always wear black, but I love it. And I've got my little sparkly bag as well to go with. So this is the bag I'm taking, which I got for my hen party. And I need to fill it actually. I've got a lip, two lip liners and a lipstick and some chewing gum in there, but I need to get my card holder. So ready to go. I need to sort my hair a little bit. And maybe add some lip gloss. I can't decide whether to keep the matte lip or lip gloss but i'm gonna end this vlog here don't forget to go and check out anna louise's website in their discount that they've got off and also if you want to shop my code i'll leave all the links in the description box down below but thank you so much but thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to the channel and of course i will see you in my next video